again, Clutter here, and today I'm super duper sad. Um, I have been pre-recording all day, and I'm super tired. I went to bed really late, and what happened is I was making the bad girlies for Totally Spies. I recorded it yesterday or the day before, I can't remember, and I went to edit it today, and all of the footage for the speed... Um, for the speed creator sim was gone. Um, I don't know if I deleted it or if I forgot to press record or what I did, but all of the footage is not non-existent. I don't have the footage anymore, sadly. I put so much effort into creating these three girlies for you guys. I'm really sad that <laughs> I feel so bad that I can't show you guys the process of how I made them but I will be putting these guys up onto the gallery when this video goes up um, I think I would have already put it onto the gallery but yeah um, I really just want to cry right now because I looked for like half an hour and it was very I usually keep my usually I keep my recording folders pretty neat but for some reason because I've been pre-recording for my holiday um, they were really messy so I must have while I was I'm really tired I've been staying up till 3 a.m. every night while I've been back so I must have tried to clean it up a little bit and somehow deleted it unfortunately so these girls are like the anti um totally spies girls they uh are like the opposites of clover alex and sam so i thought it was going to be a really cool idea to make the bad girlies um as i had already made the good girls and you guys would have already seen that video by the time you're watching this so this is Mandy and I've just put her last name as Violet and I try to make her look sort of evil as you can see with those really thin eyebrows but she still looks pretty fashionable I have to say myself I really like her outfit I tried to base all of the outfits off the cartoon show itself so yeah, she actually does wear a blouse like this a lot in the TV series. I hope you guys have watched Totally Spies and I don't sound like some crazy person. Um, I gave her Serial Romantic because like Clover, she is crazy for boys. So I made her a Serial Romantic. I made her a snob, materialistic because she is from like a uh, affluent family she's a rich chicken and she is also hot-headed I didn't want to make her mean because I do remember in some of the episodes Mandy seemed like she was sort of nice so I didn't want to make her mean um, I think she just either grew up wrong or <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with Mandy but she's pretty manipulative manipulative she can be nasty. She can be a mean girl. Oh, yeah. So I'm going to show you guys all of her outfits. So we got this one, like I've already showed you. Um, she has this formal wear. Basically, these three girls are meant to be the opposites of Clover, Sam, and Alex, like I said. Um, there is also this one. I tried to keep Mandy's outfits very purple and violet-y because that is her color. Her sleepwear and this is her party. I really thought this outfit suit her. I wanted everything to be sort of um, 70s vibe also and 70s or 8, 90s between both of them I guess. I think the color scheme is very 70s but then the actual outfits themselves are 90s sort of. So that is it for Mandy. I really wish I could have shown you guys this process. I'm actually like crying inside right now that I have to make this video because I don't want to just let this go without any video. I had to make something because 
I wanted I wanted to share this. I put a lot of effort in. Um, this is Caitlin, and I put a name Vergara. I don't know why. Or Vergara. I don't know how to say that last name. That is Sophia's last name from Modern Family. I just randomly chose that last name. Um, she has really crazy big amazing hair in the cartoon, but I wasn't able to replicate that in The Sims 4 as we don't have a hairstyle like that. We do have like an afro, but that is not the type of hairstyle she has. She has like big wavy hair. Um, but this outfit is also inspired by the cartoon character. She does wear sh chokers in the cartoon. But they don't have spikes, but that was the closest I could get to it. Um, she is a party animal, self-assured, a bit of a snob, and also lazy. I really like her outfit. So her formal is this. Pretty nice. Everything, like I said, is very pop, and the colors are sort of... Um, purpley and that pink like magenta um, her pajamas um, I like her party it's really simple and nice and she does wear like dresses like this in the cartoon also I did research this by the way I had to research because my memory is not that good I watched this TV show when I was like I don't know 11 <laughs> I was pretty young so I don't remember totally here is her swimwear so yeah, I'm, I think her and Dominique were, are like very close friends. They're like best, best friends, really close knit. And they seem to be Mandy's only friends from what I remember. And in my head, I kind of feel bad for Mandy because I feel that Caitlin and Dominique would definitely ditch her if something crazy happened, like if they were in, like, I don't know, if something selfish happened, like, I don't know what type of situation, like, if they had to choose over each other and Mandy, they would choose each other. They would definitely, they would definitely ditch Mandy. So I kind of feel sorry for Mandy in that sense. This is Dominique Kate, and in the TV show, in she wears um, heels and stuff. Like, they all wear heels, to be honest. But she wears crop tops, so she's pretty fun and a little bit nasty, though. They're all mean girls. But she definitely has a bit more of a fun style to the other girls. And she is also Alex's rival. And I'm not sure if that has to do with her hairstyle. Because they do have the same hairstyle in the cartoon. Just different hair colour. She is a party animal also. She is mean, a snob and squeamish. I kind of feel like I should have put one of those as childish. But how about we change that to childish wherever that is yeah that suits her so much more so i will show you guys her outfit outfits um this is her um formal i really like this one this is probably one of my favorites i really like this one with the eyeshadow. I think the eyeshadow looks so good. I'm still crying inside. I really wish I could have shown you guys this whole process. Um, this is her athletic. I forgot what that word was. I really like this athletic. It looks really neat. I like it. And her pajamas look very comfy. I want to go to sleep. It's late here in Australia while I'm recording this. So I'm tired. Don't want to think about PJs. Um, this is her party wear. Really pretty and girly. I like it. I love those shoes too. Those heels are, they're like wedges. They're really nice. I love them. I want like a white pair of those in real life, please. Um, and this is her swimwear. So yeah, guys, that is all of the mean girls from, um, from Totally Spies. I'm not sure if they are actually called M.I.G. I know that Mandy has a like club called the Mandy is Great Club, like M.I.G. That is so ridiculous. Why, Mandy? Are you really that? Really? Are you like that, really? 
How, how could she be like that? <laughs> I don't think there's anyone in real life who would make themselves a club called M Myself is Great, like basically. Oh well, we still love you, Mandy. We still love you. <laughs> okay, guys. Well, I think I'm going to leave this video like that. I will be putting the download link for these girlies down below. So you guys can have both of the groups in your world if you desire. So, um, yeah, I'm really sorry again that this isn't a speed... Um, create a sim. I really, really wanted it to be, but the universe did not want, want it, apparently. Oh, it makes me so sad. Um, so yeah, I will stop rambling and let you guys go and maybe play The Sims. I don't know. <laughs> don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.